What is up guys, and here are the top 5 seeds for Minecraft Pocket Edition 1.20. In this first seed, you will spawn next to one of the oddest clusters of buildings I've ever seen. There is a villager's outpost, a woodland mansion, and a village all interconnected within this small area right here. The opportunities for building and storytelling here in this world are almost endless with these rare combination of buildings all in one place. But don't worry, we've got better things to come. This next seed is incredible and honestly quite silly. You have a villager outpost stand. You have a villager outpost spawned right on top of a shipwreck in the middle of a desert village. Now, unfortunately, if you want to save these villagers, you're going to have to get in here pretty quick because obviously the pillagers are going to take them out. This is a super fun setup for buildings and of different storytelling that you can tell. Not to mention, it is within an awesome biome that is one of the rarer ones out there. And just look at this guy. How could you not want to be around with this fella right here? Yep, definitely a great seed in my opinion. This next one here is for you storytellers out here. If you go a little bit away from spawn, you will find this stranded shipwreck. It's in the middle of this super huge ice biome here. And I think you can make a super cool setup and base here if you were so inclined. Not as many rare buildings near spawn in this one, but a super awesome naturally generated object right here. Number four, you will spawn in this beautiful jungle biome with some panda friends eating some trees. And if you go just over this hill here, you will find an incredible village in the middle of a lake with a jungle temple and a ruined nether portal right here. This honestly, I think is one of the coolest seeds i've ever seen and i will probably play through on a survival world of my own village right in the middle of the lake has some great options for storytelling not to mention it looks awesome plus this village design is great for making sure your villagers don't run off last but certainly not least we have this fairly large village right here but wait there's more if you go just a few blocks over this mountain right here you will find another village which has its very own blacksmith now the options here are endless. You could create two warring factions, you could build bridges and have them work together. It's really up to you. As a bonus, there's also this beautiful waterfall here in the background that you could do some landscaping with. But wait, there's more. In the middle of these two villages, right on the very top of this hill here, you will find a ruined nether portal. Now you can take the gold from this, you can take the loot, and you can create a portal to, nether, to the nether right here in the middle. And I think the options that you have with this seed right here could be a lot, a lot of fun. But wait, there's more. If you like Minecraft Pocket Edition, subscribe to this channel and check out my Minecraft Pocket Edition Survival Guide, which will teach you just about everything you need to know about playing Minecraft Pocket Edition.